Hello everyone, welcome back on Nestor Memo channel. Guys, I am Ram Kasting, Unity game developer, YouTuber and blogger. So friends, in today's tutorial, what we are going to learn is that we are going to learn that how we can play video inside the Unity and we will play video in two types. First one will be inside the canvas and second will be how we can play video on cube means any mesh where you can play your video. So let's start the today video and if you are new on the channel make sure subscribe the channel if you want to ask anything so just drop in the comment box. First of all we have to learn that how we can play video inside the canvas. You have to create a UI where you want to play your video so first of all just you have to create raw image and just click on the 2D so basically this is the area raw image where we are going to play our videos so this is the raw image and we want to play the video in this area so how we can play the video so here is a one folder that is a video and i have taken my two blocks here so we are going to play here so first of all what you have to do is that you have to just click here right click and then you have to create and then you have to go on custom render texture so click on the custom render texture and give the name video render so what is the custom render texture Re custom render texture is a texture which can play on any mesh at a run time means it will it is a dynamic where you can change your texture at a run time okay so for what it does is that basically rendered on your game object so first of all you have to give the size what is the size of your video so here is you have to put your size like 1920 1080 okay so this is the size and what you have to do is the raw image and then you have to place here okay now you have rendered this texture but what you have to do you have to do is that you have to take one video player so here is one video player and that video player you have to assign one clip whatever clip you want to play so let's suppose i am assigning this clip and this clip we have to render on this and this will be rendered here on the image okay okay so what we have to do is that video player so we have assigned the player and now we have to pass the render so now we have passed the render okay and let's play the video okay so here you can see that we are able to play the video on ui what i'm doing i'm taking one raw image where we are going to play the video we need one video player and on video player we are just putting the that video and that video should be rendered on any render textures so what we are going to do is just so on video player we are assigning one clip and this clip should be rendered on a render texture so we are assigning the target textures and that textures is rendering video here okay so here you can see now what we have to do is just stop this canvas and now we have to play a video on the any maze it it should it can be a maze it can be a cube so let's suppose i am taking one so first of all just create one game object video and here i am taking only cube i can take cube i can take plane so now i have taken one plane okay okay now i want to play my video here okay so you can 
you can just adjust according to yourself just i'm sharing you that how you can play your video so just go on the video so click on the video player and here you get clip in video clip you can play url or video clip so cdn is also work so don't worry about it you can play any url youtube link as well as any cdn link okay so now you assign your next blog so here you can see i have assigned video clip and what we need we need again target render textures so we have already created if you don't have so you can just create custom render textures and then you can give our size and then after that on video you have to assign that render textures okay and what we have to do is that this video player is getting on this and this will have to go on the plane so last time we create the raw image but now what we are going to do is that we have to give the textures because basically mesh take textures so just put here and now we can play a video <laughs> What is the plus point let's suppose you are using any chroma key uh, means your video is uh, totally suited on the green screen and now you want to play as a png image like png image not a png image but something similar to png means uh, if this video is suited on this area so that will be play okay and uh, here you can see you, here you are, you are not able to see so I am just giving you a bonus point that you can go in the video renderer and if you want to play as a PNG image like the particular area which is suited in the uh, green screen so you have to use transparent okay in transparent whatever what it does is that it's play only the main part of the video not the other blackest part okay and uh, currently is opaque and if you want to play from behind so you have to use both but in standard i'm not able to see so what you have to do is you have to change from standard to urp if you want to play video from backward side and if you want to play from the front so that is not a problem so in urp what you get in in lit material you get front and both so you have to choose on the both so at that time you will able to play the video okay and for the better quality you can turn on the emission so it will give you a more uh, better look so this is the way you can play a video inside the unity so there is two, two way to play inside the unity first one is in ui second one is on any mesh and sometimes so particularly we are using the unity video player and if you want to use advanced level of the video playing in unity so you have to use av pro av pro is a paid video player so that is a very advanced so you can utilize if you want to use basically that kind of a video player we use for volumetric video play okay so hope you enjoy the video thanks for watching have a good day and don't forget to like subscribe and share and please check out me on my blogging channel mr rk blog and follow me on instagram mr rk blog